Six, a shakeup in Hardin County. Today, county commissioners brought in some new blood to run ESD number six. That is the emergency services district that serves the people of Silsby. County commissioners appointed three new people to their board of directors. Good evening, Southeast Texas. I'm Jordan Williams. It's good to be back with you tonight. County Judge Wayne McDaniel says this is part of a push for transparency, especially when it comes to spending. Told News reporter Kayla Shote is here tonight to explain. Kayla. That's right, Jordan. Judge Wayne McDaniel tells me the court received backlash for often reappointing ESD commissioners. So this is the first time the Hardin County Commissioner's Court has had a formal nomination process to elect ESD commissioners. I think the citizens of Sealsby are going to see uh, uh, excellent service out of their ESD going forward. Hardin County commissioners voted to approve three ESD number six seats today. Commissioners wanted to bring in new blood to improve services. Not that it's been terrible in the past. I just think we're going to improve things. Tommy Bartosz is one of the three new commissioners. Definitely have some big shoes to fill. I'm personal friends with, with some of the guys that were on there and I know they've done a great job. I just hope I can do half the job that they did. ESD number six provides fire and EMS services to the Silsby area. The ESD commissioners are in charge of budgeting, all the operations and spending. Bartosz feels prepared for this new role. Emergency coordinator for the city of Silsby almost 20 years. And I served in the police department for 30 years and city manager of Silsby for 10. So uh, I have a lot of knowledge of budget, had a lot of knowledge of the emergency services. Judge Wayne McDaniel says he's grateful for all the hard work the previous commissioners put in. But he said it's time to improve the ESD's transparency with the public when it comes to how ESD number six operates and spends tax money. That uh, we just want to make sure that the citizens are receiving the very best, best service that they can. We want to make sure that those who are serving those positions are being transparent and being professional. And I believe the decision that we made today will ensure that. Bartosz looks forward to making those improvements. This is extremely important to our community to be able to have quick, accurate, professional services. And, and that's what we're going to bring to the table. That's what we're going to we're going to keep. Also today, for the first time, Hardin County Commissioner's Court appointed leadership for ESD number seven. That's the newly created district that serves Votaw and Thicket. In studio, Killa Shote, 12 News. All right, wishing the